Celebrating summer with Good Day Live. Summer in Linton, Indiana, and it would not be a celebration without Cheryl Hamilton from oh, the Linton you. Stockton <laughs> Chamber. I'm just saying that because I know this lady. She's a ton of fun, <laughs> and what's more fun than Linton for the 4th of July? That is true. Um, it's a full day. Um, and that, that phrase, you'll like Linton, really happens on July 4th. So um, anybody that's not familiar with Linton on the 4th, I know Channel 2 is very familiar with Linton. Um, we started the morning at 6 a.m. from 6 to 9. We had the Civitan, um, I call it green egg, or green ham and eggs breakfast, not <laughs> Dr. Seuss, green <laughs> eggs and ham. It's all about the green ham, and um, Edgar Green taught him to bake these hams in burlap in, in the ground in pits. That ham just melts in your mouth, and eggs cooked to order. You know, I've had the pleasure of trying that and seeing it cooking. It's amazing. It, it's amazing. you got to get amazing. there early to experience that. Mm -hmm. Six to nine, you said, is the time Six a.m. to nine a.m. At, at the Linton Fire Station. But that all leads up to the largest parade in the state of Indiana. The largest Independence Day parade. It in the is state. so fantastic, folks. This is, talk about getting your spirits up for independence. Nothing does it like this parade. Yeah. You know, I've been in Linton 21 years, and I can't imagine being someplace that doesn't does have a parade on July 4 now. Yeah. You know, it's like, what do people do the morning of the 4th if you don't do a parade? And you, you do know? it right down there well, in Linton. <laughs> yeah, we, we do. I think we do. You know, we've got a great mix of music. We've got always have lots of floats, which is sure. unusual. You know, for a lot of parades, they, you know, they have what we refer to as stuff. But, you know, we're usually pretty lucky and fortunate that we have homemade floats. I mean, they're not professionally done, and they're fabulous. Yeah. Just really cute. And, Great I, ideas. I think in the Wabash Valley, it's become a tradition for a lot of families to know that this is how they start their 4th of July. It is true. And it's special for you all indeed. But it's not just the 4th, because I want people to know there's things going there, on this week with the Freedom Festival, There right? is. There is. So we kick off July 1 with a carnival. So our carnival runs till the 9th, um, open 6 p.m. each night, $20 every night. They can ride all night long. And um, we do have a Little Miss and Mr. Contest, baby contest on July 1 at 7 p.m. Um, and entertainment throughout the week. And it's local entertainment, you know, so we have some really talented folks in Greene County. I, I am amazed at how many talented people we have in such a small community of Linton. You know, and I think, we, we, you know, it's funny because you said you'll like Linton, and that's, that's exactly the theme that you put, but there's nobody that goes and leaves that doesn't understand and embrace what that sign means when you come to town. That's true. Everyone is welcoming. People are kind and loving, and I really feel like the 4th of July is about embracing America and Linton does that right too. Just good wholehearted American people. Yeah, you know, so our, our parades on Monday, we'll start seeing probably Friday evening people marking their spots off on the parade. I mean, you will, you can go down the parade route the easy up tents won't be up, but they might be in place. <laughs> People are going to have the caution tape and their stakes and their chairs. And I mean, to think in this small community, they are marking the places off three or four days before this parade is yeah. amazing. I, I didn't understand it until I, until I became a resident. And if they can stay all day and, and hang out, they get to see a great display at 10, too, they don't do. they? The fireworks? 10.30. 10 10 30. Okay. And where's, where's the best place to see those? So there's two places that would be... Truly really fabulous, the front of Humphreys Park, so the city okay. park, the front of the park, or at our Litton Baseball Diamonds. Okay. They can sit in the bleachers there and, and see them. It, it's a little darker there, so then there's parking okay. available in that spot. But again, it's about a 30 minute show. It's an incredible show, and it's it is great. very patriotic indeed. So, again, folks, there's lots going on down there. July 1st, we've got the baby contest, we've got all the events coming up on the 4th. You start in the morning with breakfast and you end with fireworks That's at night. Right. And if you if you want more information, visit LintonFreedomFestival.org. That's correct. You also have a Facebook page folks can check out there. We got the website up for you. And of course, all this information will be at MyWabashValley.com. July 4th, don't miss it. You'll like Linton indeed. That's right. And we have liked celebrating summer with you all in Linton. Thank well, you. Looking forward to it again. All right, Cheryl, thanks for being here. And stay with us because we've got more to come on Good Day Live.